In this video I'm going to show you how to repair your Sony uh, 40 inch LCD uh, TV. This is the model KDL-40S20L1. It's a 40, uh, 40 inch uh, Sony TV. And the problem with this TV is that uh, it shuts down, it stays on sometimes for a second or two or sometimes maybe a few minutes. Uh, and it just uh, turns off and uh, after that you get like about four blinks so if you're getting four blinks uh, that means there's a problem with the uh, power inverter and so you have to take out the uh, the back cover of the TV and locate the uh, power inverter which is next to the power supply I'm going to uh, point it out so this is our power supply right here and the power inverter it's actually this one over here which is uh, two different boards uh, there's one over here and there's one uh, over here and both of them are on the on underneath this um, steel um, shield and so you have to unscrew it if you want to get to the uh, to the inverter board uh, but basically the main problem is that there's a problem with the uh, the connector over here. I'm gonna zoom in. There's a problem with the connector over here. So most of the time you can get away with just uh, unplugging this connector and uh, cleaning it maybe with a toothbrush, a clean toothbrush, a new toothbrush uh, or uh, just a uh, a new paintbrush and uh, just clean the the, uh, the leads on it on both sides so you want you have to unplug it and clean the leads on both sides and then plug it back in and that might solve the problem um, if that doesn't fix your problem uh, then you have to um, um, unscrew uh, take out all the screws underneath this uh, steel shield and uh, basically replace the uh, the uh, two um, inverters but the main problem is with the the, the, the plug over here uh, the connector it just becomes loose uh, due to age it just becomes loose so you have to replace it and that may cause that loose connection may cause a different problem uh, with one of the uh, transformers it may blow a transformer or it also may blow one of the uh, three fuses that you have here uh, but that's the main problem. This connector over here, it just becomes loose and it doesn't make a good connection. So like I said, if you if you use the clean it up, take it out, clean it up, plug it back in, if that fixes your problem, well, uh, that'll do it. If not, you have to replace the uh, two inverters. Uh, but basically the problem is with this uh, connector over here. Um, before you do any work, I do suggest that you keep the TV unplugged uh, from the power supply for at least several hours because you, you're going to have a really high voltage over here on the, uh, on the inverter. So you want to make sure that uh, the capacitors are, uh, do not have any current when you're working on this uh, inverter board uh, just to, to be safe. Uh, so just make sure you leave the uh, TV unplugged for several hours and I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.